Assuming all goes according to plan, Frozen State should be out this week. Officially out this week. Like, out in full. We'll see how that goes. I'm actually looking forward to seeing what the very final build of this game looks like. It will kick my butt, but we're going to play it anyway, because that's just how we're going to roll today. I'm just kind of checking to see what we have here. Oh, take the spaghetti. Definitely take the spaghetti. I do like me some pasta, so, you know, it's cool. We'll take that. Wristwatch. Yeah. All right, so now we need to go loot the rest of the house. Yes, thank you very much. I know about doors. I, I probably should turn the hints off, and yet kind of afraid to turn them off, because there, there might actually be some really useful stuff in here, because... Gotta admit, I don't quite entirely 100% know everything about the game. You know, that's kind of the fun. I like in, I like exploring and finding out new stuff. It keeps it interesting. Um, hockey stick, that'll be cool. Definitely digging that. Adhesive tape, raspberry jam, battery. All right. Okay, so we're finding some good stuff so far. Ooh, canned mackerel. Hmm. Just what I want. Blech. Guess we should take the empty thermos here. Another cabinet we can search. Some 9mm ammo. Alrighty then. Wow, no bags this time around. Not a bag to be found. Alright, well, there should be one more area to check, and that'll be this one right here. We'll check this chest of drawers. Wow, did, did I already check that one and it was empty? Oh, we're going to be in a bad, bad spot here. I'm just telling you, it's going to be bad. Um, Alright, well... Let's go ahead and wear that. That'll give us a little bit of protection from the cold. We should go ahead and equip the wristwatch. Just that way we have a wristwatch handy-ish. Definitely need to equip that guy. And then the spade, probably not a bad idea to equip that as a secondary item. Now, I wanted to check out the Nagant 5. You use 762 millimeter ammo. So that actually doesn't really help us out right now because... Uh, yeah, no. Although... You know what we might be able to do right now? We can make a hockey knife. Oh, we can't. We need another level. Crud. That's no good. That is no good. Das ist nicht geht. Geht gut. Wow. I suddenly had a brain moment there and I couldn't remember how to speak. Um, 1927. I don't think we ever bother with this door. So you know what? Let's go ahead and bother with this door. We will enter the code... And I should be able to open the door now. Alrighty then. It is nice and cold outside. That nice little yellow meter is going to drop down in a hurry because we don't have any winter clothes. We don't have that. We only have punk outfit because this dude's a punk, apparently. Alright, this is probably why I never go out this door because then I end up running around the wrong direction. And I take the long way around the house. Can we, can we check that out? Nothing. Alright. Do we have a cellar over here, maybe? No cellar. All right. Cool. It's all good. We'll go ahead and hop out. And I suppose... Um, well, we can always hit a telephone booth somewhere else. Let's go ahead and just... Right away, let's just go ahead and hit another area. Yes, I would like to leave this location. Thank you very much. Um, I, I don't know what that is, but let's go ahead and go there. Why not? Is that the Explorer? Is that... Oh, that's my truck. Oh, I see. I didn't realize that I've not ever bothered to go to this particular spot in the game before. Granted, it is a little different every time because it's, um, you know, all procedurally generated. But, yeah, this would be my truck. Find the parts to fix the Explorer. We need a radiator, a gearbox, and a cylinder head. So I guess we can walk away from it now. Bummer. Wow. Alrighty then. Um, if I pull up ye oldie map, I guess there's not much to see here, so... I guess we should just go ahead and get out of here and move on to another area, so maybe we can find somewhere else that would be a little better for getting loot and that sort of stuff. Well, I'm a little concerned about, uh, you know, dying. So what do we have over here? I don't know what this one is. This is woods. So we're going to go explore the woods. That doesn't sound at all like a bad thing, and in fact, here, let's go ahead and chop this tree down. Gather a couple logs. It's going to be heavy. Yeah, I knew it was going to be heavy. Ah, crud. That's the problem I have right now is I don't have any bags to carry this stuff, so... Kind of thinking maybe we should do something like, um... You know, building materials. Big planks. I guess we can create some planks. And... 
um, you know what? What the heck? Why not? Let's just do maximum big planks. And we can eventually turn those into small planks if we need to. Alright, let's go into stealth mode here. Let's take a look at the map as well. There's something to the complete opposite direction of me this way. What is that? Looks like it's a wall, maybe, or something along those lines. I guess we can move a little faster. Oh, it is. It's a big fence. Interesting. Why is there a fence right here? Was there something else over here originally? I don't, I don't understand. Hmm. I don't know what I'm doing over here. But I, I don't think the woods is where we need to be right now, but... I do want to grab some frozen berries here. Oh, crud! I didn't even see you sneak up on me. I was too busy looking at the, the berry bush. Crud. Wow. Oh, man. That's like half of our health right there. That's how quickly it goes away. Oh, my goodness. This is so not a good start. What do you have on you? Uh, we'll definitely take the cloth rags. Take those guys. We're going to leave that infected meat. That doesn't really do us any good, I, I don't believe. Maybe it does, somewhere, somehow, but I don't think so. Let's go ahead and kind of return to the corner over here. I think that's where our our little uh, zone was. Crud. Okay, there we go. Good, yeah. Yes, I do want to leave this location. I'm not really feeling it right now. Oh, man, we got a lot of area here we can explore. I kind of don't want to go too far right now if I'm just going to level with you. I'd kind of like to stick close to the base here so we can return. Um, you are docks, maybe? Something like that? A lake. Sure, you know what? Just for giggles, let's go explore the lake. I don't know. Have I actually made it to the lake before? I think I found like a docks or something before, but not the lake. Let's, let's check the inventory here. I don't want to take the cyanide. I, I'm decidedly against the cyanide. What is... Ultra Zidal. Amplifies human skills and abilities. That that doesn't sound like a bad thing. Is there any way I can make some sort of um oh I don't know bandage? Uh, we don't we're not really bleeding though. I was kind of thinking more along the lines of something that will heal me. Um maybe not. Crud. Big bandage. We can make a big bandage, but we don't have any clean bed sheets. Do we, do we have, uh, we don't have any soap or clean water. Wow. We just, we don't have anything. Not at all. This, this is, this is not good. A germicide bandage. That would be really good. Hmm. Yeah. We're, we're kind of not in a good spot here. Although just for giggles. Oh, what is that? Why, why is there a dead deer over there? Oh, because there's a guy that... The, oh, crap! Crap, crap, crap. Stop crouching and just run! Run, you dummy! Wow. That was... That was bad. All right, can I... Can I pick up the fuel can? It's too heavy. Crap, I really need a bag or something. All right, rabbit. Sorry if I lead the... The demons to you, because, um... Wow, more fuel over here, huh? Oh, man. Or whatever these creatures are. Maybe they're not demons, but they're definitely not friendly, whatever they are. Hello, moose! If this is like a real moose, I don't want to anger it. Don't look at me. Here, you're, don't look at me. We're cool, Mr. Moose. Marty, we're cool. What is this? Can I zoom in a little? What is that? It's a madman! And he has kefir. 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 I don't know how to pronounce that, but I know it's some sort of... Wow, that is the smallest lake I've ever seen. Hmm. I was going to say it's some sort of, like, dairy thing, milk and etc. Wow. Fishing place. Oh, okay. I, I don't have a fishing rod. Okay. So maybe that's why it's so tiny. Maybe those are just meant to be small so you can kind of... It's kind of like cutting a hole in the ice. You know, that sort of thing. Oh, is there another monster creature thing up there? Nope. Okay. So we got Big Man over there. Remember, he's guarding the... Whatever that is. The buck or the, the moose. Uh, you don't look very happy to see me. So I'm going to go ahead and back off here. And let's go ahead and leave this place. Yep. I'm going to leave. Because I feel like that is the best course of action right now. 
Oh, man. Where do we go? Crud. I guess let's go over here. Can we can we explore around in here right now? Maybe there would be something in here worth worth looking at. I, I don't really know. Where are we? Hmm. Okay. A petrol station. It's interesting that it didn't give us any indication that that's what this was. I don't know if that's normal. I'm going to assume it's normal, but I don't really know. Okay, let's go ahead and just not not crouch for the moment. Uh, yeah, let's kill the gram for that metal. Oh, let's go ahead and crouch now. Let's not make any noise. Yeah, you can't see me over here. So we can just go ahead and continue on. Uh, maybe we can make it into the petrol station. That would be nice. We can't grab the fuel because, you know, it weighs too much. We already know that. But maybe we can kind of see if there's anyone. Crap, there is. Oh! Do you see me? Crud. Crud. Let me, let me back up. Back up. Get out of range. Okay. There is someone inside there, but I think we managed to sneak around them a little bit here at least. Let's go ahead and head over this way. Let's head to the car. Uh, nothing in the car. That's kind of a shame. What is this over here? Looks like a little bookcase or something to me. Um, whatever it is, it's nothing. It's just a, a little crate, apparently. A little wooden crate. Let's go ahead and pick up the metal scrap. Okay, we're going to try and... Wow, you are on me like a hawk. I don't have anything at all here that will help me out in terms of uh, health, do I? Not a thing. I guess we could try taking some anthrazidol to see what that does. I got a bunch of it. I mean, we're already off to a kind of crummy start here, so... You know what? What the heck? Let's take some anthrazidol. That doesn't sound like that can be a bad thing at all. Wait a minute, I can't, I can't eat it? Ah, crap, are you kidding me? How do, how do I use that? I want to, I want to eat it. Take some anthrazidol, man. It'll do you good. Crud. Um, am I, am I even anywhere close to, to being able to, I'm probably not even close to another level. Ah, bummer. All right, well, I guess we're just going to go take the, the hatchet to this thing's face and hope for the best. Because, um... I don't know what else to do right now. Alright, can I... Can I smash you through the window? Apparently not. Okay, good to know. I thought maybe it'd be kind of fun if I could smash it through the window, but, uh... Nope, not to be. Although, that does beg the question of... How do I get in there? Raspberry jam, handkerchief, empty, empty tin. I'll go ahead and take that. I can't jump in there, so, um... How do I get in there? Ah, crap, I'm stuck in jumping mode again. Ah, that bug is still around. That's good to see. All right, there we go. Stop jumping. But how do I get in there? I can't go in that way, apparently. All right, well, is there a door right here that maybe I can open? Mm, can I can I unlock it? Right. Apparently not. Oh, big scary guy over there. Well, big-ish. Definitely scary though. Those guys are those guys are not to be trifled with, as I keep finding out. Uh, it's starting to get late and it's getting cold. We're gonna have to get out of here. We can't we can't hang here. We're gonna have to just take some of the stuff back home and figure out if there's anything we can do with it there. Ah, crud. All right, let's go this way. Let's kind of run around. And then let's take a turn here. Turn, buddy. I know the, the zone is over here. We can go ahead and head over here. Let's go ahead and get out of here. That warmed us up, too, which is kind of handy. That's that's convenient. Let's go ahead and head back to the back to the house. Back to home. I don't know, maybe we can maybe we can get a little bit of health by, by sleeping or something. That would be nice. I don't know if the game works that way, but one can hope, right? It's kind of my plan. All right, can we get anything in here? Is there anything in here? Boxwood. Nails. I guess we'll pick up the nail. It's always nice to have nails, especially when I, you know, nail something down. I guess since we're outside, I, I was going to do this in another zone, assuming we found one. Let's go ahead and talk to Eureka. 
Are you still functional? Here, yes, yes, yes. I need parts for my explorer. All right, yes, yes, yes. Are you feeling better? Good luck, citizen. Oh, and it's dead. Um, any information for me? Yes, you're dying. You're not a computer, nuclear reactor. It can't be lost. Tell me what to do. Where's the panel? Hey, come back. We're not finished end. Okay, good. So that got us the quest started. Let's go ahead and get out of here, man. It, it's um, it's getting cold. And you can see by the snowflake, it is chilly, chilly, chilly. All right, this should be the front door that I theoretically can get in. And now that I know I can just run straight out to the gate, I don't need to run around the entire house again. That was silly. How are we doing on our various needs at this point? We're not all that hungry. We're not all that thirsty, but we are all that cold. All right, we do have some junk too. So what can we do with crafting? Can we make any, can we make any armor? fur coat. Nope, we don't have it anywhere near the stuff we need for that. We could put some building materials together. Survival, I guess we can make a campfire. We never mind, we cannot make a campfire. We don't have any thread, rope, or hide. Hmm. How are we supposed to make this stuff when uh you know we're we're a lowly level one. How much how much trouble is it to get to level two? I just, I am, um, I don't even know. I, I'm just kind of at a loss here. Wow. All right, well, we're going to have to dump some of this stuff off. That that has become clear, if nothing else. So let's go ahead and put some of this junk in there. We're going to dump all of the planks in there. They're heavy, so you can go in there. Metal scrap, you can go in there. Um, I guess we can keep the single stone. That's not a big deal. BPC battery. I, I don't even know what those are for. The hockey stick doesn't really do us any good right now, nor does the kitchen knife, at least until we're able to actually get a level and rope that stuff together. Or something, anyway. Alright, where does that leave us on inventory? 19 out of 25. That's not bad. We do have some stuff on hand. Oh, I guess we do have a flashlight. We should probably equip that, too. That's probably what the batteries are for. That would make sense. I meant to look for that earlier, and I did not. It's okay. Port wine. I'm just taking a look here. Um, food. I guess we could make some a pot of spaghetti. We don't have any water, though. You know what? I do want to experiment a little bit, so let's go outside. Let me switch back to my spade, I think. No, how do I do that? That one? Where's my spade? There it is. There's my spade. I want to try something right quick here. Let's go ahead and close the or open the door rather. Let's go outside. I know it's nice and cold out here. And I just want to um, oops, wrong button. Again. Extract some fresh snow. So I don't know how much we need here. I'm just gonna say let's extract uh let's do three fresh snows. That sounds good. So I am walking backwards just to make sure nothing is coming in that I cannot see. It is dark in here. Wow, I apologize. I'm apparently going to have to take care of this. This this is dark. Can I... Let's see, where is my kitchen? Uh, that was the kitchen I was just in. Wow, I can't see anything. Can I make a torch or something so I can see? That'd be really handy if I could do that. Nope. All right, it's cool. All right, we're about, what about the bazooka? Can I... What happens if I put fresh snow in there? Uh, container. I guess I need a thermos now. Where's my thermos? Um, or a cooking pot. I guess I need a, a camping pot and then an empty thermos. No? But an empty flask. Can I, can I do that? And then what if I do that? Does that give me some fresh, clean water? I kind of thinking this should. I'm going to watch it for a second because I don't, I don't quite know just yet. Um... Can I... Oh, no, look at that. Okay, so there we go. So that is taking all of that stuff out. It's using my cooking pot. And then theoretically here, we're going to have some fresh water. Flask with dirty water. Um, okay. So now I'm confused. And I'm warm, at least. I'm warm. So, you know, how do I make clean water? Ah, crap. Now I need charcoal. I can't cook it? Ah. Uh, Bummer. Can I can I make any food with dirty water? I mean, it doesn't seem like the best idea. Oh, where am I supposed to get charcoal from? Um, can I get charcoal from putting wood in there? I don't know. 
Not really sure. I can't see anything, so apparently I need to go to bed. So I'm just going to go ahead and rest in my bed. And we're going to call it a night right here. It's uh, 10 p.m. I, I kind of feel like we should rest a good, a good eight hours. I feel like that'd be a good idea. And we'll pick up in the morning on the next day. So I will catch you on that one. Till then, thanks for watching. See you later.